Has anyone here ever been drunk before? Okay, is anyone drunk right now? Has anyone here ever been drunk before, done something stupid, then sobered up and went, oh, fuck. Put your hand, yeah, some of you got both hands up, right? Take a little sidestep. Has anyone here ever been really angry? So angry, in fact, that you did something or said something that when you calmed down, you were like, oh, what did I do? The receptors in the brain that are responsible for the intake of narcotics, barbiturates, and alcohol are the very same receptors in the brain for all of your emotions. It starts with electrical impulses in the brain that work through different neural nets depending on the nets that have been created based on what you perceive. It then tickles a little gland in your brain called the hypothalamus. And depending on how that hypothalamus gets tickled will determine the neuropeptides that the hypothalamus releases. The neuropeptides go down through the pituitary gland into the bloodstream and then it permeates your body and connects with every single cell in your body. And it, like the neuropeptide looks like a key and it hooks into a cell and goes the behavior of the cell starts to change. Your cells either start vibrating at a high rate of frequency that represents more of a positive emotion, or it starts vibrating and oscillating at a lower rate of frequency. It typically relates to more of the negative spectrum of emotions. Next time you're at a party and someone says, how are you feeling? Try this one, go, I'm consciously aware that my vibratory state is high. <laughs> and you can feel that shit. You can absolutely feel that shit. The question is, is are you aware of it? This is where the dangers of emotions come in. M emotions are dangerous. There's nothing wrong with them, but they're like kids. You don't want them driving the car, but you don't want to stuff them in the trunk either.